In the far west Pacific, the sun is just breaking over the China Sea. Another day is beginning in Southeast Asia as the warm, humid night slowly turns into a hot, humid day. If it were a different time and a different day, this quiet early morning countryside would be a thing of beauty. But it is today, another day of war in Vietnam. In 1968 and 69, there was a, a half a million troops in Vietnam. If you were a male between the ages of 18 and 20, you were either in school, in the army, or dead. I had no choice. I ask for your support. I pledged in my campaign for the presidency to end the war in a way that we could win the peace. All of this eruption and demonstrations were a result of the uh, invasion. I was extremely patriotic. And to learn that the country I loved and the government I respected <laughs> was deceiving us <laughs> at one turn after another for purposes that I didn't agree with. What started out as, I think, for, for on my part, as, as faculty and, and some people in the community opposing the war, turned out to be a student anti-war movement. The students took it over to their credit. It was a nice day. Everybody started to march and we just walked down to the bridge and closed up 169. It's lucky somebody didn't get killed down there. I mean, I'm serious. There's, there, it's lucky someone didn't get killed. You know, all, all it would have taken was one shot and that would have been a massacre.